Hello, welcome to Set Radar Talks. My name is James Peckham. I'm here with John McCann. And we're here today to talk about Spotify we taking are. on YouTube. Uh, it looks like they're going to be doing video content. That's what the rumours are saying. That's what the rumours are saying. Yeah, people familiar with the matter uh, are saying that yeah. Spotify have been talking to YouTube content creators um, about potentially doing a deal with them. So, which obviously signals video content via yeah. the streaming service. Um, it's not only YouTube people they've been talking to, they've also been talking to more sort of traditional media companies as well. Um, so it looks like the they're sort of pretty serious about this. Yeah, definitely. So it's going to be music-based content. That's what we're going to assume, isn't it? I assume so, but there's, there's also talk about co-created stuff as well. So maybe they'll try and look to do some more different things as well. Not yeah. just, you know, your bog standard music videos. There might be more sort of a slant towards maybe interviews and and, and anything else. Really. Yeah, and there's also rumours of them like covering live events and that kind of yeah. thing through through the service. I mean, because there's so, word that Tidal will yeah. will go through the live events, so it's yeah. potentially Spotify positioning itself yeah. early doors to protect itself. But I can imagine that. them setting themselves up at, say, Glastonbury or any yeah. other festival and just setting themselves up there and then doing video content in that kind of way. Yeah. Maybe not Glastonbury because they have like um, deals with the BBC and stuff, but, but places like Coachella or something like that. It would it definitely actually? make sense, wouldn't it? Yeah. Um, Spotify do have an event on May 20th. They're keeping tight-lipped about what that actually is about. Yeah. But this could be the announcement that we're going to see then in a few weeks. Mm. Them going, right, we're going to go into video. Let's get ready to rumble. Interesting. So would you actually use it as a service if it was around? If there was no additional money on my subscription yeah. that I'm already paying, I'm a premium member. Um, but no, I, I wouldn't pay extra to have music videos and stuff. Yeah. I, I just use that's YouTube good, for free. That's a good question. Will it come in with the free with Spotify free as well, yeah. you would assume it would only be part of the premium service. Or covered in ads if it wasn't yeah. the free service. It would yeah. be interesting to see how they play it and yeah, if the pricing moves because Tidal is more expensive. Yeah. Um, so yeah, it would be interesting to see how they play it. I personally wouldn't pay more, would you? No, probably not. I wouldn't, yeah. I, if it's part of the premium subscription, I think I'd go for it, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't pay extra on top. Cool, well, yeah. there you have it. Let us know what you think about Spotify potentially taking on YouTube in the comments below and thank you very much for watching.